everyone, it's Desiree, and I am here with Spellbinders. I know, you are seeing House Mouse, but Spellbinders has now launched a House Mouse collection, and they are adorable. I have chosen the Daisy Mouse, so cute little mice going along the grass with the daisies, and I love the sentiment. Friends make the world beautiful. I pulled out my colored pencils. I love to either use watercolor pencils or regular colored pencils when it comes to this type of a stamp. Since it is red rubber, it is extremely detailed. I'm going to get this positioned in my stamp positioning tool towards the bottom of that line. And this piece is cut to four by five and a quarter. And I am going to use my Versafine black ink to stamp, I'm sorry, I'm not going to use my Versafine black ink. I'm going to use my Simon Says Intense Black. Because I was talking about watercolor pencils, I use my Versafine ink on that one. So this pad that I have from Simon Says, it's faded. I need a new one and I will be getting one, but I love the fact that this is a faded black. So it's a light charcoal which I think is perfect for a stamp like this. When you have a stamp that, in my opinion, when you have a stamp that is this detailed, to have that rich black or dark charcoal, I feel takes away from your image when you add the color. You want a soft color. Would these look beautiful with no line coloring? Yes, they would. They are trickier though. To, to get that effect. So a very pale, light gray, but not super gray, is perfect for this. I have zoomed in and you're going to be able to see all of the coloring. And I have very basic colors that I will be using. So nothing too fancy. Um, and I am using my Arteza. This is the 120 collection that, I'm sorry, this is the 48 in the tube collection and I really do enjoy the Arteza colored pencils to work with. Sit back, enjoy, I hope you grab something to color and I'm going to turn on a little bit of music while we color.
Now that our coloring is done, here is our panel. I think these mice are so adorable, absolutely adorable. So let's mat this. I'm going to use my liquid adhesive and I'm going to place this onto a piece of black cardstock that measures four and a quarter by five and a half. And I'm going to put that directly down onto my standard A2 size card base, which is also four and a quarter by five and a half. And this has now become a side folding card. Color pencils are my favorite coloring medium. Now you may have yours. It may be watercolors or alcohol markers. Whatever you enjoy, pull them out and have fun with the Housemouth collection from spell, with Spellbinders. All the products that I used will be listed down below. And if you have a question, leave those down below and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Enjoy your day. Have fun creating your art. Because remember, it is what you do create, no matter how you create it. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit that thumbs up and ring the bell for any notification when another video is available. Till then, always remember what's most important. Always be creative. And I'll talk to you in the next one. Till then.